Hey, what's up you guys? Welcome back to my channel. If you're new, my name is Danielle. You can subscribe down below if you ever so desire. Today, I'm so excited. I've been wanting to do this video for a while. I'm up close and personal today. I'm going to be talking about and showing you guys my current, or actually not my current, my all time favorite gold jewelry. I love accessorizing and I'm really, really into just gold jewelry. I kind of just have been my whole life. I've never been a super big silver fan. I just feel like gold looks better on me. And a lot of you guys asked me to talk about you know, my go-to staple gold jewelry items, whether that be rings, bracelets, necklaces, earrings. I have a lot of gold hoop earrings I wanna show you guys, and I'm gonna link as many things as I can down below that I can find. I just got my second piercing um, in the beginning of this year, and I've been really having fun accessorizing with different gold earrings, and I love wearing gold rings and everything of the sort. So I thought this video would be super fun to film, and a lot of you guys asked for it, so. Here we are. I hope you guys find this any sort of helpful, and if you do, make sure to let me know down below and any other videos you want that might be like this. And yeah, without further ado, let's get started. We're gonna zoom in a little bit because I'm gonna show you guys stuff up close. Hey, what's up? I know we're really up close, but I just thought this would make the most sense. All right, so I'm gonna start with my everyday jewelry that I don't take off of my body, I guess, every night. So yeah, these are the items that I wear every night. My earrings kind of change, but for the most part, what's on my hands and wrists stays on. So, we're gonna go through this. Some of it is really expensive, keep in mind. Um, but yeah, that's what this video is all about. I'm showing you guys what I, what I like. So on my right hand here, I wear these two rings as kind of like a double, and it's actually really satisfying right now. I have a tan line from them, which is so hype. So this is the Cartier love ring, and this is the Cartier, um, like, wedding engagement ring. I forget the exact name of it, but this is the love ring, the most popular one. This one's a little bit thinner. This one I actually got as my high school graduation gift from my dad. It was very, very, very kind of him. And then this one I bought for myself with my own money um, in New York City this past December, um, like for Christmas or like during Christmas time. So that's that. I just keep these two right here. I really like the look of them and they don't slip off and they're awesome. On this hand, I just have this one ring. I guess I just have two middle finger rings, which is kind of weird, but that's just how it worked out. Um, why do I look so pale? This ring is from Majuri or Majuri. I don't really know how to say it. It's just like a simple gold little circle band, um, but I love it. I don't ever take it off. It has never turned green and I've had this on, I don't even know, maybe a little less than a year. I forget when I got it, but I've had it on my finger for a very, very long time and I'm very impressed. I always love when I find jewelry that doesn't turn green. And lastly, on my wrist, this actually never comes off. It can't, well it can, but you screw it on. This is my pride and joy. This is something that I bought for myself when I hit half a million subscribers on YouTube. It was a really cool moment. It was really exciting. So this is the Cartier Love Bangle and I have wanted this for years. I just love the classic look of it. I think it goes with absolutely everything and I haven't taken it off since I got it in September. So maybe it was August. No, I think it was September. Um, but anyways, I love it so much and this is what I wear every day. As for earrings, I've been wearing this combination a lot. This little mini gold hoop earring is from Urban Outfitters. It was super, super cheap. And then this is actually one of my favorite pairs of earrings that I will have linked down below. These are the Love AJ Amalfi hoops, I believe. I got them off of Revolve and I think they're actually only $45. So love that, they're the perfect size. I wear them to the pool, I wear them wherever. I've actually accidentally showered in them before and it didn't really bother me. They stay on great. I really suggest these. If you're looking for like a staple gold hoop, these aren't super heavy. As for necklaces, I've actually been wearing this one a lot. I believe it's from the brand Goriana. I'll have it linked down below. It's just a simple gold bar necklace, but I've found that it goes with absolutely everything. And sometimes I accidentally forget to take it off before spin class and it doesn't like, bang around a lot. It's just super light and I love it. So that's what I wear absolutely every day. Now I'm going to get into my favorite gold hoop earrings because that's always fun. First up, these are my tried and true. These are literally $6 hoop earrings from Target. I hope they still have them. If they do, I'll have them linked down below. I know H&M also has similar ones to these and obviously there's nicer brands that, um, have these earrings. They're just a lot more expensive, but they're probably a little bit better quality. But these are awesome. They're hollow again, which is nice. So they don't weigh you down your ear. I absolutely love the look of these, especially with just like a sleek ponytail uh, or bun. I actually just got these earrings, so I can't say a ton about them, but I just love the look of them. They're from the brand Uncommon James. I got them in like the accessory section of Sephora, of Sephora. 
Nordstrom. These are similar to the ones I showed you guys before. I like how they don't completely connect in the back. I just love that look. Um, and they're just a little bit thinner, which is nice. And they're even lighter, which is great. I would assume they're also kind of hollow. Um, but I love these earrings. I love the back of them. They're super comfortable on. They're $56 from Sephora. Go get you some. I think these look great, again, with just like a sleek bun or even if your hair is down with like a nice flowy dress for a summer dinner is perfect. These are also from Nordstrom. They're similar to the ones I'm wearing right now. I think I'm going to put these on in my first hole to kind of give like a just a super cute layered hoop look. Um, but yeah, these are only $19 and I just thought these were a great option. They're just many little gold hoop earrings that I feel like you could sleep in if you want and they're also just great for you know stacking if you have multiple piercings is that a thing stacking piercings probably not these are another favorite of mine I hope I can find them or something similar because these I literally wear these all the time they're like these braided gold hoop earrings they're like a medium size and I got them at Urban Outfitters like last year um, but I love them if I am in doubt on what to wear earring wise I just put these on they're super light and they give like a really pretty feminine look my tried-and-true gold star hoop earrings that everyone and their mother always asks me about I think I need to work with some pliers and fix these because they're not I think when I took them off last time I kind of bent it they're basically just mini gold hoop earrings <sighs> so this is hard with a little gold star dangling from the bottom and it, this also really looks good on the ear I wear these to bed I've had these for um, um, I don't know like eight months now or something and they're freaking awesome I got them off of an Etsy shop so I will have them linked down below because you guys always ask but I know they also have similar ones at places like Brandy Melville and Princess Polly so it's really up to you on what you want to spend and where you want to get them from but these are awesome. I would just look up like gold mini hoop star earrings or something like that. That's what I did. Last pair of earrings I want to show you guys are kind of newer to my collection, but they've recently become a favorite. These are actually from Anthropology. I always go into Anthropology because I want to like look at their like cute little knickknacks. I never really buy clothing or accessories, but these earrings are so darn cute. They're like little pave gold hoop earrings. They're super, super comfortable and they look super cute on. I think these are a great summer find just to wear with your little bikini or your bathing suit or again, like a nice summer dress or if you just want to wear this with like a graphic tee, I think these are a great statement. I am just really clumsy right now. Um, but yeah, I love these. I only have one bracelet other than this one I've been wearing a lot. I got this at a boutique in Athens, Georgia, um, where I live. It's called, I think like Tree House. It's like a random boutique on Clayton Street. And she had all these beautiful gold beaded bracelets and I love this one. They have like a simple one, but I liked this one with the little details. And it just looks so cute and very um, feminine on. I don't really know, I just like it. It goes well with this bracelet, a nice touch, or I'll sometimes put it on this wrist with it. Um, any sort of gold beaded elastic bracelet I think is a great statement. Staple. You can also get a few and stack them if you want. A little arm candy, TBT. As for necklaces, as you guys know, I love this one. My other current favorite necklace I got from Adina's Jewels. I love this. I always get so many compliments on it. It's a great layering piece. It's just this gold clasp, and this is like the front of it. This is not the back, it's the front. Like, this is the pendant of the chain. So, it's actually really easy to put on, too, because you literally just clasp it and it just swivels to the front. I've had this set from the M Jewelers for a while, and I just am constantly wearing these two together. They're great because they're just made to layer together. They're these two little gold pendants. Uh, I'm not exactly sure what's on the front of them, but they're little gold coins basically and when in doubt I always just put this on because it looks great with like a simple dress or a simple like top or bodysuit and these just are perfect But you can also wear them separately Which I really like if you want to like layer them on their own or just wear them on their own So yeah, this is an M jeweler set. I will have it linked down below. Hopefully they still have it But I love this one speaking of gold coins. This is tangled right now and I'm really mad But I wore this to Coachella one day. It's just like a three-tiered gold coin necklace and I actually got it on Amazon guys like I literally just went on Amazon looked up gold coin necklace and it was super inexpensive it's great it's more like costume jewelry but it's great for you know festivals or you know for summer dinner stuff like that but yeah I really need to untangle this but I just had to show you guys last but not least from a boutique called Fabrique that I do know they have in other cities I got this one this is just a simple gold um, moon necklace with little like rhinestones on it i'm not exactly sure it was very inexpensive maybe like 20 bucks um but i find myself wearing this a lot it also goes well with a necklace like this i love layering necklaces i love the look so much i'm constantly trying to find new pieces to layer with because it's just so much fun i hope you guys found this video helpful of some sort again i will have everything i talked about linked down below 
Um, I, I don't know, I think it's really fun to watch videos like this. I love, obviously, like favorites videos. So this is kind of like favorites, but also my gold collection. I don't really know. Um, obviously not all of this is real gold, and I know some of things are more expensive than others, but you guys really requested this, and I wanted to film it. So yeah, <laughs> I hope you guys are having an absolutely amazing day. Have a great summer. Hope you're doing well, dog. And we'll talk very soon. Bye-bye, guys.